welcome back to Bonapapa. Today we are going to prepare together a lovely savory muffin recipe using zucchini and carrots. Two ingredients that you can easily find all year round and also they are lovely combined together. They are delicate with a nice sweet background flavor. These muffins they are loaded with nutrients. We are going to use avocado, we are going to use almonds and also vegetables, zucchini, carrots, so they are a perfect snack or light meal for your little ones. I love to bake these muffins and give them to my kids at school in the lunchbox. They are small and they are super easy to be handled by little hands, by toddlers. This is also a lovely baby led winning idea. You can simply break the muffins in small bites, place them in front of your little one and he or she will love to grab the little pieces and enjoy eating them. But let's start together this easy, simple and nutritious recipe. First thing to do, in a big bowl, we are going to mix together the flour, the almond meal, the baking powder, the baking soda and the salt. And we're going to mix. In another bowl, we are going to mash the avocado and you want the avocado to be nice, cream and ripe. And also we're going to add the eggs, combine everything. I already peeled and grated the carrots, I'm going to add them. And I already grated the zucchini and squeezed out the extra water. I'm going also to add the zucchini. It's time to add the grated parmesan cheese and the oregano. Mix everything together. Slowly and delicately, I'm going to combine the two mixes together in one bowl. I already prepared my muffin tin that they are lightly greased with some coconut oil and I'm going to fill each hole. The oven is already preheated at 400 Fahrenheit degrees and I'm going to bake my savory zucchini and carrot muffins for 18-20 minutes. And as always, the toothpick rule. If inserting a toothpick in the center of my muffin, it comes out dry, it means that the muffins are ready. You can enjoy the muffins nicely warm directly out from the oven or you can store them in an airtight container in the refrigerator for up to three days. And yes, you can even freeze them, sealed bag or airtight container in the freezer for up to three months. I really, really hope your kids are going to enjoy this recipe. If you're looking for similar recipes, simply check all the links in the area here below and we are going to see each other next week with another recipe from Buona Papa. Remember to subscribe to the channel, it's totally free and you will receive a new recipe from me every single week. Ciao, ciao, ciao!